Well, today on the show, we're actually over in Gulfport at Singing River Gulfport, formerly Garden Park, and they are in partnership with uh, Oshners and talking to two uh, folks that are involved with the orthopedic surgical part of this, which is uh, something to have brand new over here. Uh, we have uh, Dr. Philip Myers and your nurse practitioner you've been in partnership with for such a long time, Jay Smith. So. Uh, Thanks for uh, you know having us over here, seeing the great new facilities. Matter of fact, the uh, the new uh, operating room downstairs is amazing. And, and if you would, uh, Dr. Myers, give us a little bit of uh, background about yourself. So I've been practicing in the area for some time now, and uh, ultimately, about uh, two months ago, we decided to hitch our wagon to the Singing River Gulfport team. Um, and my partner Jay and I became Singing River uh, Gulfport Orthopedics. Mm -hmm. um, so we offer a diverse spectrum of orthopedic services all the way from hand surgery to joint replacement. Um, so we're just really enthusiastic about joining the Singing River team here in Gulfport. Now, I thought it was uh, um, interesting that, uh, talking about uh, doing orthopedics and everything. The, uh, the table that you had downstairs, it, 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 it uh, I don't know, it's, it's kind of crazy because I had, I had mentioned casually, I said, yeah, eventually I'm going to be needing some uh, hip surgery, uh, I'm sure, because of my age. And it, it happens, might not to all of you. But uh, what are some of the most common ones that you have done uh, in the past uh, that you do the most of, let me say? So the, the most popular way that I'm doing total hip replacement now is through an anterior approach with that fancy robotic looking table that you saw mm -hmm. um, and really what that allows us to do is that allows us to approach hip replacement in a minimally invasive fashion mm -hmm. which leads to a quicker recovery um, and uh, that way patients can get back to activity a lot sooner because we actually don't cut any muscles or tendons whatsoever when we do that procedure. Really? We use an interval to access the hip joint so patients can recover from a strength and activity level much quicker. Okay, okay. Now, and I'm sure that you work with uh, athletes, a lot of athletes as well. I mean, because you see on you know TV all these athletes, well, they just had to have uh, go to the orthopedic surgeon and have something done, knee messed up, and all this. Do mm -hmm. uh, you see a lot of that? Tons of tons of young athletes and tons of tons of middle age athletes, tons of older athletes. Um, really, our goal when we treat patients is to maintain lifestyle. Mm -hmm. So whatever their their level of activity is, we try to get them back into whatever game or activity they're trying to get back into. So sports medicine is really one of our passions, treating young, motivated, and athletes of all ages to, to make sure that we can continue their activity level. Talk about the Total Joint Camp. The Total Joint Camp is an excellent program that we ha have here at Singing River Gulfport. And Basically, what it allows us to do is it really allows us to help address patient expectations for the surgery. We see things on TV and advertisements and you talk to friends and that, what that does is that creates some expectations in people's minds, mm -hmm. but the expectations always aren't really in alignment with reality. So what joint camp allows us to do is it allows us to take patients, educate them through the process of the joint replacement process, and it allows us to make sure that their expectations are in alignment with what they really will be going through as far mm -hmm. as the joint replacement goes. So it's really a great opportunity for patient education. It allows them to meet everybody here at our team at Singing River Gulfport, all the way from the nursing staff to the physical therapist. It allows them to develop some, 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 some understanding of who they're going to be seeing when they're here right, so that right. everybody's not a stranger and they are very comfortable with the process. And it's, we've had an overwhelmingly positive response with this and patients have really enjoyed it and been grateful for it. And I think that would be uh, an important thing to do too is uh, the collaboration whenever you have, I mean every every patient is going to be different. Mm -hmm. So you know, knowing what uh, what each one's role is and this patient's recovery is very important. Yeah, when 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 we have patient a patient that goes through a major joint replacement surgery, it's extremely important for us to treat that patient in a multidisciplinary approach with nursing, with therapy with our surgeon team, with the pharmacy team, we have a whole host of specialists that come on board to make sure that that patient's care is optimized and it's the highest standard. Now, nurse practitioner Jay Smith, who right. is a partner with Dr. Myers. Yes. I got a question, I got a, uh, you said something earlier, we were downstairs and we passed by this cart full of tools and you mentioned something that was funny that you should always ask an orthopedic surgeon if they do one or the other. Tell me, tell me that story again. Well, we were just saying if you we were discussing tools and drills, and I said you can ask an orthopedic surgeon if they can rebuild a car engine or build a house. If they can't, you may want to proceed to someone else because 
that means that they're pretty pretty smart, but questionable with their hands. And ah. It's just an old running joke that we have. <laughs> but we, we like to do carpentry work on the side. And mm -hmm. Now, you have practiced in the area for some time now with Dr. Myers. Well, I've been here, yes, for quite some time. Dr. Myers and I have been practicing for several years together, but I've been doing orthopedics since 2005. Why orthopedic surgery uh, instead of some other field? Orthopedics is... Um, it's our modern day carpentry essentially on the human body and we, and we do love it. We like taking care of patients. There's a lot of need for orthopedic um, services in the community. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of um, orthopedic injuries that we have and essentially, as I like to tell people, our, our joints are like tires on our car. Eventually the tread wears out and sometimes you can patch the tread or you can replace the tire. So we like to be there to help patients and do those things. You recently had a very unique patient that was in all the news. Talk about that. So I got an interesting phone call from Dr. Alexis Dulon and Dr. Sean Perry at the Mississippi Aquarium and they had a shark who has a common problem with a kink spinal cord for lack of a better word mm -hmm. and they were having some problems swimming and eating so we decided to put together a community medical team and we actually performed a surgery with um, Dr. Joe Cox with uh, Bienville Orthopedic Specialist and Jason Lowry with LSI uh, Distributors to repair this shark's ver vertebral body and get it back in alignment where it would um, be able to swim and eat and it's so far doing well. It was a very um, interesting experience. Now if a human patient wants to come and needs to see you, what do they do? What do, they do? So on the human side of things, we, we, we do not need referrals at our office. Essentially you make a phone call to the office, we'll get an appointment as soon as possible. You can see Dr. Myers or I at, at your choice. Mm -hmm. um, it's. We're very excited to be a part of the Singing River Gulfport orthopedic team. Dr. Meyer is very skilled in multiple orthopedic procedures, mm -hmm. and um, I'm excited to be a part of that as well. Okay, and of course you can go to singingriverhealthsystem.com for uh, more uh, information on that, uh, or you can call 228-205-6825 um, if you'd like to uh, you know, make an appointment with you. And uh, you are here at the Gulfport, you know, Singing River Gulfport, as they call it now, at the Old Garden Park building. Has uh, I guess the shark would be probably on the top of your list of the most interesting surgeries that you uh, orthopedic surgeries you've done. Yes, it, it definitely is. Uh, although the last time I made rounds on Stella, she didn't talk to me very much, so <laughs> I gotta, I've got I've got to figure that out. Um, I've done multiple. Take her some fish. Yeah. <laughs> Thank God she's eating now. She That's was good. eating before, so we're, we're excited and thrilled about that. And, we're happy to be a part of it. That's awesome. Well, I know y'all are excited about new and uh, wonderful things that are be going on here at uh, Sing River Gulfport. We are. We're excited, and we and we're here to give the community and the patients the highest standard of care that we possibly can. All right, Jay. Thank you so much. Yes, sir, Appreciate thank you, you for having us again. If you want some more information, you need to make an appointment. Let them help you here at Singing River Gulfport. They can't do anything, so